All right, guys, we are here to fight Maxi. Actually, the most, one of the most insane fights I've ever seen. Just looking at it, it looks insane. But anyways, here's our team. Leading off, we've got one HP, Primeape with Cross Chop, Rock Slide, Reversal, Endure. We've got oh, 67 Slacking, Crush Claw, Super Power Shadow Ball, Encore with a Lumberry. This is the only one I have. Well, no, the only one you get, you're supposed to get. Um, a Cargo, Ancient Power, Earthquake, Explosion, and Heat Wave. Salamence, Air Slash, Dragon Claw, Crunch, and Rock Slide. Flygon, Earthquake, Dragon Claw, Strength, and Fly. And Porygon 2. Fry Attack, Ice Beam, Thunder Wave, and Recover. Let's get right into this. So I pre-damaged my Primeape to exactly 1 HP to ensure that Reversal kills Tyranitar through Intimidate. Oh, I guess we should watch this, huh? Yeah, Groudon's like, what the hell are you doing, dude? The orb is blue, I'm a red guy, and then just runs away. Yeah, that wasn't my fault, <laughs> bro. Let's fight this, though. This music is so baller, man. Yep. Okay. <sighs> Maxi sent out Tyranitar. At 1 HP, this should absolutely destroy Tyranitar. Alright. Let's see it, Primeape. Let's go! Okay. Whew. That's the first one down. Next is Executor. Now, I have a Salamence in the back that, switch that beats this, but if I switch in on Psychic and it gets crit high rolled, the, the battle just ends and I wipe. Like, I can kill this after, but I won't be able to win the battle after that point. So I'm gonna unfortunately just have to sack Primeape to Solar Beam here. So Executor on, sorry, on Maxi. In the Sun is 196 speed. My Salamence at level, ooh, one second. At level 68 is gonna be 194 speed. If I got one more level, it would have been a speed tie, and I'm not gonna go to level 70 for a fight this or uh, for a fight, but that's not even before Team Aqua Hideout. So we just gotta take a psychic here. Don't get crit high rolled, and we'll be fine. All right, and now this is a roll. It's a range in my favor to kill the Executor, and I didn't get it. Okay. So this, so if I'm at 116 HP with Salamence, this only has a 30% chance to KO me, and I don't really see any other forms of play right now. Actually, what speed is this again? It's, oh wait, 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 actually guys, I might, I might have thought of an idea. Okay, I'm gonna go Porygon here, on the Psychic, then I trace the Chlorophyll, I take the Psychic. This should not do too much. Okay, that did way more than I thought it would. Good grief, man. Okay. I get my... I get my Citrus Berry. We're going to outspeed and KO this with Ice Beam. And let's see what comes out next. I am faster than everything, but I think that's mostly irrelevant here. Flygon comes out! Okay, that's perfect! Okay. So, this Porygon at level 67 is guaranteed to kill Mac, uh, Maxi's Flygon with Ice Beam. Precisely. So I outspeed because of the Chlorophyll and then knock the Flygon out. Let's go. I actually didn't think Flygon was coming out next. That's so good for me. Okay. We're in this, boys. Gengar comes out. Okay. Um, Gengar... 
Maxi, I'm at minus one special defense. Let's see, um, sorry, I'm just doing some calcs to make sure I'm making the right play here. Slacking level 67. Yeah, not even a crit kills me, so I can just go straight slacking here. And at level 67, slacking is guaranteed to kill Gengar with Shadow Ball. Nice, okay, perfect. Goodbye, Gengar. Wait, yeah, 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 never mind. That's, that's what I planned for. <sighs> if I got crit there, that would have been really bad, but I had to risk that. Goodbye, Gengar. You will not be missed. Okay, who's next? Who's next? Arcanine. Okay. Arcanine, does this have extreme speed? Um, it does. So, Arcanine is always going to go for extreme speed here, I'm pretty sure, because slacking's faster. So this is a free switch into Macargo. Okay. Nice, that's really good. I think it's Flame Body Macargo. Um, it doesn't matter because he's a fire type, obviously. I'm just, uh, thinking aloud. So, now my Macargo at level 68 should be able to take two solar beams. Oh, wow, he heat waved. That's shocking. <laughs> yeah, there's not a single, um, solar beam roll that can kill me next turn. This is great. He can crit me, of course, but I still have, um, I still have, uh, some revenge killers in the back. Alright, please don't crit me. Please don't crit me. Let's go! Okay. Goodbye, Arcanine, man. Oh, wait, what? It lived? Oh, are you, you gotta be kidding me. Extreme speed never kills, so AI is gonna go for either Heat Wave or Solar Beam here. Actually... Yeah, HPS doesn't kill either. And I'm out of heat wave range, so AI has to solar beam here. Um, I'm gonna check really quickly. Salamence. Level 68. Solar beam into intimidated extreme speed. Solar beam on a max roll does 22. Intimidated extreme speed does 47. Salamence should be 100% safe here. Okay. Okay, solar beam, perfect. I was worried he might heatwave there, which would put me in a really precarious situation. Okay. And I get the... Ooh, actually. Extreme speed on a crit on Salamence isn't even a guaranteed kill here. Nice. And he doesn't extreme speed because he doesn't see a kill. He just goes for HP Ice there. Dope. I think we've only got... <laughs> we've only got, uh... Entei left. Alright, let's go. Maxi 2. Ooh, fly... Uh, Entei. This is my Flygon. Entei. Um... 67... Okay. It should be completely safe to just go into Flygon on Ancient Power. An Omni Boost would be Omega cringe here. I just need him to not Omni Boost on this turn because he's never going to go for Ancient Power again. Oh, thank god. Okay, I think I'm safe no matter what he does now. Earthquake doesn't KO this, but it should do about 70-75%. Yeah, that did- that- that was like a max roll, pretty much. Good lord. Okay. Solar Beam does not kill me even with a crit here. Yup, okay. I should get my Citrus here. Oh, I don't have my Citrus. Oh, shit. I have to sack something here, because he got the crit Solar Beam. He's gonna E-speed here. Okay, let's evaluate really quickly. Um, I need to pull up the sheet to see, um, 
How many things am I gonna really need this McCargo for? Man, McCargo is one of my only fire types left, though. I can't sack it. Okay. Um. Shit, man. I need Flygon. I need Flygon. Why does Entei have inner focus? I think I go Porygon here. I've- it's just the most sackable member right now. And- Let's double check. Porygon to see if it can live here. I doubt it can though. Yeah, there's no way, it's not even worth calcing. Goodbye Porygon. You were a brave soldier that saw me through much. Ah, that crit sucks so bad. <laughs> oh, that was a- for those of you that don't know, um, that was a roll to kill. I could have lived that. <laughs> it's okay though. Now we're gonna go Salamence. I can't believe he- he freaking extreme speeded, man. Sacred Fire was literally a guaranteed kill, he just found the high roll E speed and got a crit. Are you kidding me, man? So BS. Okay. Got Salamence here. We should just be able to finish this off with a rock slide. Get fucked, Maxi! Absolute destruction, man. Oh, God. We made it past Maxi. Albeit with some really unfortunate casualties. Primeape and Porygon 2 both going down. Her. I planned to sack Primate, but losing Porygon 2 the way I did really, really sucks, man. Oh. Well, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch you next time. Probably wiping an Aqua Hideout. We'll see.